I am finally continuing this. Um, it has definitely been a while, uh, but I finally made it back here. And now I shall continue. Wait, oh, I was, I was totally confused. Oh wait, can I convince Murray to come with me? That'd be cool. I would like that. I think he wants to be alone right now. Mm, well then I pick him up. I don't know if I want to carry him around. He's kind of annoying. It's my mm -hmm. pal, LeChuck Ship. Well, if he's your pal, then why don't you want to pick him up and bring him with you? Ah, uh, well, whatever. Hmm. Okay, so Danger Island. Uh, where's that ship? Over there. Swamp, 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 swamp. Whoa, there's a little me running around all the way over to there. What's his name again? I completely forgot. Huh. Hmm. <laughs> I want to pick up the fountain. Mm, no. <laughs> He's like, no. In memory of the chickens who gave their lives during the Great Puerto Pollo Potluck Jamboree of 1621. No. Oh. Well, uh, okay. Nah. Uh. Ooh, alleyway. Let's go there. Detail. Ooh. It's mine now. I don't want to disturb the mystic powers of the hat. It's empty. Or is it? <laughs> nah. I wonder if there's a part in this play for a dashing rogue pirate. Oh, this is a play thing. Mm, no. Hi. <laughs> is that all you're gonna say? You gotta say more interesting things to yourself, or else you're gonna you're gonna get like bored or something. Looks too big for me. Everything is too big for you, then. Just kidding. It's stuck to the trunk. Hey! It's a sticker from Blood Island. It says, Blood Island is for bleeders. A message from the Blood Island Tourism Council. Hey, maybe the performer who owns this trunk knows how to get to Blood Island. Licking it won't get it off. Oh, that's his lick? Ugh. It won't talk back. It's an old Maybe trunk. Maybe will. It's covered with stickers from many faraway places. It looks too heavy for me to carry. Well then, I oh big. I'll take that. No, I like the natural look. What's back there? Oh, let's just to swab or not to swab. No, no, that's not right. Uh. Come on, slap it. You've got to get this right. The show opens. It's an actor. Thespian. Then I kill uh... Caesar. Follow that up with a little soft shoe. Buddy pal, friend. Yo. <laughs> I'm a dangerous pirate. Who I'm are a you? dangerous pirate. Who are you? Cromwell. Slappy Cromwell. It's not my real name, actually. My agent told me my given name just didn't have star quality. What was your given name? Rex Fortune, Adventure Seeker. I see. Uh... Have you been to Blood Island? But of course. Blood Island was once the place to be if you were an artist in the Caribbean. Those were the days. We were young and wild, pushing the limits of our craft. Oh, what risky, daring performances we gave. We weren't afraid to shock or offend the stodgy, mainstream sensibilities of our audiences. Oh, what did you perform? Dinner theater, mostly. Could you tell me how I can find Blood Island? My agent, Palado Domingo, always handled the travel arrangements. He would know how to get there. Hmm. Any okay. idea where I could find him? He's a member of the Brimstone Beach Club here on Plunder Island. You might catch him there. 
Can I join your show? Let me be blunt. You just don't have the hands of a spear carrier. You have no idea how often I hear that. Huh? Acting is my life. Let me join your show. I was a tree in my kindergarten play. We already have a tree. Oh. Wait. Acting is my life. Let me join your show. Sorry, this is a one-man show. Hey, what am I? Chopped liver? No, not liver. Liver has a more appealing stage presence. Uh... Of course, what I really want to do is direct. Why? <laughs> I've always dreamed of my own production. Titus Andronicus on ice. Brilliant! Please, I'm gonna keep pushing this. Show? Sorry, this is a one-man show. Uh, well then... Okay. Carry on. I don't remember. Is the water ballet before or after my mad scene? Oh, I know. I don't want to touch him. He's covered in flop sweat. A pirate by any other name would still reek. Arg. Next. Time. That is just disturbing. <laughs> the pirate also why is How'd it? How'd you get roped into doing this show? I'm a spokesmodel, actually. But what I really want to do is act. People just don't take you seriously when you're a spokesmodel. How surprising. Yeah, isn't it? Uh, Break leg. Thanks. What fools these men with morals be? I don't think he's interested. Oh, I'm never going to get ready for this performance. Hmm. Oh, yeah. Ooh. That whole lend me your ears bit. I can't use a paper mache headstone. I sure hope I. It's Yorick's headstone from Hamlet. Oh, it's from Hamlet. I think I'll let him rest in peace. Act <laughs> four, scene eight. Join me, Rose. It's too big to carry. We had better looking trees in my fifth grade school play. And then I do some Dang. Nah. I'll teach these parrots what real culture is. Is there any way you to like... Ooh, you ooh, stone, ooh, wait a second, you how did... Very you... Old meat. Uh... You... Are you sure you want to win? Worse than unlaundered things. The freak? I was trying to remember which button it was to... There are more food in your galley, Horatio, uh... than are dreamt of in your philosophy. What button was it? Then, I will release the ravenous panther, which will eat stew. Oh, here we go. Hey! Uh... Stew! If you're going to be an actor, you have to suffer for <gasps> Could I burn oh, okay. the tree? We may have to lose that part anyway. I don't want to cinch that with this ember. It's cutting into my monologue. Yeah, I don't think he'd like that. Okay. The quality of grog that be unstrained. A pin. Then in act. Yeah, I don't think he'd like that. Uh oh, ooh, I know. Oh. Yeah, I don't think he'd like that. Yeah, I don't think he'd like that. Well, I want to pay some. I know I'm gonna have to pay somebody mm. with that. Yeah, I don't think he'd like that. I don't think he'd like that. <gasps> Ooh! I can't use the skeleton arm with that. Uh, okay then. Oh, what if I give that to him? Yeah, I don't think he'd like that. Ah, uh, fine, whatever. Oh wait, maybe this mm -hmm. guy. Yeah, I don't think he'd like that. I'm gonna wake him up. Mm. I think I'll let him study his lines. Yeah, sure, that's totally settling. So, uh... Ooh, wait a second, can I... I don't think he'd like that. Okay, I thought it would be mm. like pace his feet or something. No, thank you, sir. Chewing gum affects my diction. Yeah, I don't think he'd oh. like that. Oh, oh Juliet, yada. Yeah, I don't think he'd like that. Well, I'm out. Then in act. I'll go over here then. Backstage.
I don't know what the point of that was. But Watch I did me it. make this disappear. Hey, I actually took it. Nothing up my sleeve. Whoa! Presto! Hey, it worked! There's something inside. Dang! Uh, well then, I'll take the book. Ooh, maybe I can give this to... Uh, somebody. No, the leader of a disco did make glory, so I'm about to show you want. It's a book about ventriloquism. You're no actor. Get off the stage, ya bum. <laughs> what? Well, I didn't. Just you be quiet and help me rehearse. That was funny once. Mm-hmm. That was funny once. That was that that was that 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 was that that was that 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 was funny once. Oh, Romeo, yada 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 yada. I don't want to throw my voice there. Well, that's pretty cool that I have a oh. ventriloquism thing. Um, well, can I take it now? I don't want to disturb the mystic powers of the hat. Wait a second, can I do it again? Will it give me something different? I don't want to take advantage of the mystic energies. Oh, okay. Makes sense, makes sense. So I gotta go to this beach club? That's what it seems like. Beach club. Or maybe I could, like, use the magic wand on the fountain or something. The magic wand has no effect on that. Well, Spear! Or, like, Shakespeare. No. Oh, wait. Will the magic wand have an effect on this? The magic wand has no- The, ma the, ma the, ma the magic uh, okay. wand has no effect on that. Oh, it's probably through here! Because there's water. Yeah. I'll have to get to a beach and ask about Blood Island or whatever, where I'll die. <laughs> Is there a beach I can go to? Uh, oh, there's a fort. Oh, the fort was where the battle was. Let's go over there! Yeah! Lightning speed pixels of... Whatever. Oh yeah, this is it. Mm, no. <laughs> no. Okay. Yes, may I help you? Okay, may I help you? Ah, uh, his name is Guybrush. Been rising in part of my life. Something sure smells uh, cooked. You know, Something I sure smells uh, <laughs> cooked. Got anything to eat? Sure, but hey, it's a lovely afternoon for the beach today. Not too crowded yet. There's a crafts workshop on the south beach and a swapper size glass at two and four. Water's warm and the waves aren't too high. Just watch out for the occasional undead corpse talking. watching up on shore. Might want to keep the kids away from any rotting flesh. But otherwise, the siege early today shouldn't spoil your afternoon. Just between you and me, the undead are notoriously bad tippers. So it's just as well they didn't take over the island, eh? <laughs> Let me see your membership card and we'll fix you right up. Membership card? But I'm wearing my membership t-shirt. No membership card, I see. Well, sir, you're at the Brimstone Beach Country Club in Smorgie, part of the Leisure Lovers Planned Community Country Club of the friend. Beach. I'm it's here. This is the place. Stop talking. I'm afraid I, I need if you to get don't out. have a membership card, uh, you cannot use any of the club's amenities. I don't want an amenity. I had to eat one of those while I was lost at sea, and it was terrible. Then let me also point out that without that membership card, you are not permitted on the beach, you cannot use any of our towels, and you can't have anything from the grill. Can Good I push day. him now? Can I, can I push him now? Mm, no. Uh, oh, I know. I'll, I'll push it. Mm, no. Wait, does it say... Oh, here I don't we want to carry that around. It's cold. Eh, my tongue might stick. I'm not gonna fall for that one again. Nah. Is there anything I can do with this? Well, I'm going. See ya. Wait. You can't go in there! Uh, 
That's right. for members only. Members only. Oh, yeah, I'll take one of those. I'll take a towel. Those towels are for members only. <gasps> oh, he closed his eyes for a moment. Ooh. Close your eyes again so I can take this. Ah, Those towels it. are for members only. Maybe that's not what I'm supposed to do. But I'm gonna go back. I, I'm gonna look for an area where I can get a membership card. Where could that be? I doubt in the voodoo swamp. Maybe the fort. And after I'm done checking that out, I'm probably going to end the video. Uh, well, who knows? It's this! Wait, I never got to read this. Actually. It's an informative plaque put up by the Plunder Island Naturalist Society. Untitled composition in gold and diamond. This newest addition to our public works of art was shamefully taken without authorization. Oh, they thought it was a statue? I love that. I'll read this plaque, too. Plunder Island Feral Chicken, one of Plunder Island's most common fauna and the animal for which our capital of Puerto Pollo is named. Common fauna? Oh my gosh. I don't think so. I don't think so. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna pick up the bridge. I'm that strong. Mm, no. Can I get across? Oh, wait a second, is the bridge broken? The bridge is uncrossable. That's just as well. There's nothing interesting in the fort anyway. Oh. Well then why are we trying to defend the fort if there's no point in it? Uh, well then I guess I'm gonna go this way. Mm, no. Yes. Mm, no. Yes. Mm, no. Yes. Mm, no. Okay. Fine. Ah. 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 Uh. Well, that means I can't get to the fort, right? That's where I was. Yeah. Okay. Well then, it looks like the, I've inspected everywhere. Uh, this is the Porto Polo, Fort, Swamp, Cabana. Can I go to the mountain? Where are you going there, guy brush? Hmm. I guess I'm gonna need to do something in Porto Polo then. <laughs> Uh, hmm. Well, now I know how to save! So, yeah, that's, that's happening. Um... The Barbary Coast. Well, into this. Welcome, patron, to the Barbary Coast, where every haircut is an adventure. Aye, and if you're wanting a haircut, you'll have to wait until I'm finished with Captain Rottingham here. Are you guys pirate barbers? We prefer the term buccaneer hairstylists. Great! Huh. Maybe you guys can help me find this huge diamond ring I'm looking for. Diamond ring? Yeah, it's supposedly enormous, and it's on Blood Island. Blood Island? Never heard of it. It's a funny story, really. I need it to lift this curse that's turned my girlfriend into a solid gold statue. Solid gold? Uh. Wait a second, Dude. did I just share too much? Also, why is there blood? Why is there blood right here? Ah, don't you be touching that that handle, you hair lubber. Uh, okay. I'll take the jar of combs. Hands off those combs. Those are ours. Maybe if I can get these two to leave. Ahoy there, I'm Guybrush Threepwood, Mighty Pirate. Of course you are. Okay then, who are you? Edward Van Helgen. 
not the... That's right. Mine is the name that pirates fear the most. Edward Snugglecase Van Helm. Dude! How would you like to join my ever-growing pirate crew? Your crew? Why would I want to be on your crew? It's gonna Good be question! We're going to Blood Island. Sorry, Threepwood. As much as I'd love to be out at sea again, I could never serve a captain who wasn't a gentleman and who wasn't my equal. Uh. Fine, be that way. You went yes, from pirating yes. to hairstyling. Why? The music of the sea is something that takes hold of your soul and never lets go. But the life of a sailor is a rough one, and the sea shows no mercy. It was no easy choice to leave, but I realized that I could still enjoy the music of the sea while remaining safely on land. By hanging out at the docks and singing to passing sailors? No, believe me, uh. that doesn't work. By starting a barbershop quartet, obviously. Uh. Obviously, but there are only three of you. Auditions didn't go as well as we'd hoped. Uh. We once had a tenor named Dominique, but he left. Artistic differences. Hmm. Hmm. I could be the fourth in your barbershop quartet. Uh, no, no, uh, that's okay. I was wrong. We don't need one after all. Oh, come on, I've really got away with a ballad. All right, then. Let's hear what you've got. Uh, what, are, what the heck are any of these songs? Monkey in my pocket and he's stealing all my change. His stare is blank and glassy. I suspect that he's deranged. Oh, my dear, sweet, merciful savior in heaven. Pretty good, huh? You must take an oath now, before man and God, <gasps> that you will never, ever again sing in public. So, what are you telling me exactly? Uh... Are you truly happy with this line of work? I may return to the sea one day, but for now I'm happy helping pirates look their very best. At least okay. until we find a fourth for our barbershop quartet. Hmm. Let me try out for your barbershop quartet again. No! <laughs> oh, please, please! Oh my gosh. The spirit of music is in me! All right, but this is the last time. Hmm. A popular commercial jingle. Let's do this one. Plunder, plunder, how I wonder how'd you get so doggone pretty? Home to sailors, barbers, tailors, and Puerto Pollo, your capital city. Great sainted jumping monkeys! What do you think, huh? That was yeah. even more atonal than last time! Whoa, look at the time. Got a scoop. Okay. I'm gonna stand right here. And as soon as he puts down the cone, I'm taking it. Ah! Hands off that comb, or I'll have your bangs, you thieving dog. Uh, okay. Ahoy there! I'm Guybrush Threepwood, and I'm a mighty pie. Quiet! Red. Huh? Don't distract him while he's working on me. Aye, laddie. You'll have to wait your turn. It's the pirate way. Uh, okay. Salty, pirate. Ahoy there. I'm Guybrush Threepwood, mighty pirate. So? So, it's good to meet you, Mr... Bill. Bill? Mr. Bill! That's your pirate name, Bill? Cutthroat Bill. Oh, I see. Well, yeah, that puts a whole new spin on it, doesn't it? That explains the red. How'd you break into the hairstyling industry? I saw an ad to join a barbershop quartet. Got a problem with that? No, that must be very rewarding work. What's that supposed to mean? Mean? Just that, you know, cutting hair and um, singing must be just a lot of fun. It's like a party every day. Oh my Sometimes gosh! I just don't know how to contain my joy. I get giddy 
and the laughter bubbles out of me like a sparkling fountain of mirth and gaiety. Okay, new topic. Um, <laughs> well, I guess this is where I shall save. Can I save over something? Oh, okay, so yeah, I can. Save. Okay, well, this is where I shall end it, then. Goodbye.